This is, uh, well, you know, what is it? <laughs> this is, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, man. Something that happened to me when I was very young, perhaps. Oh, actually, no. I know what I'll do. to the place where I'm staying and I realize that it's so late that I'm locked out and there was a choky dog guy they call it he's like a guy who worked a servant basically for the family I was staying with and he was like a hundred years old and he'd fallen asleep and I couldn't wake him up through the screen door I was like oh, whatever your name is free Muhammad everyone there's been Muhammad Muhammad wouldn't wake up, trying not to wake up the family's kids, but wake up the hundred year old guys. They wouldn't wake up. So finally, I decided, okay, there's one, there's like a little cot in the backyard. I'm gonna stay there. And so I, I and I kind of try to get comfortable. It's kind of chilly at night. And there's wild dogs everywhere. So about 40 minutes go by, and then I feel that somebody is shaking me gently, and I look up. And it's this guy, who's a chokidar, they call it, and it's someone who's hired by all the families in the neighborhood to watch stuff. And he didn't speak English, and I didn't speak Urdu, but he made it known that I couldn't read. No, 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 this is no, you know, in Moshkwe, it's no good. And he come with me. So I go with the guy, and we go into, obviously, his house. And it's uh, it's about the width of the bathroom in the apartment I currently have. Literally, you can touch one wall on either side. And there's a bunk bed, and then there is a little room, and then a cot. And there's a baby in the cot. And a little further, there's another bed, and there's, there's a woman in it. And she's asleep. with me but I didn't want to try to play it and so he you know he kind of motioned like you know go ahead you can stay in the lay in the bunk bed so I get in the bunk bed and then he's kind of nudging at the guitar so I take out the guitar and very, it's electric and very quietly I start playing this kind of stuff you know dreamy stuff and there was only one light bulb in the whole place, and it was a blue light bulb. And 
I was so high, but even if I wasn't high, I would have been because it was just this beautiful, dreamy, blue light, very dark, sleeping baby, kind stranger atmosphere thing, you know, no English language, no Urdu. And then the guy starts to sing. Voices like a woman's or a small child, and it's beautiful. And I have no idea what the hell he was singing, and he had no idea what the hell I was playing. But it was beautiful. Here's hoping you have at least one night like that. To danger. Joe Harbour. Quiet Hall is coming up very soon. Thanks, Scott. Thanks, Joe. Thank you for coming. Thanks. All right, Saint. Let's make some more noise for Mr. Joe Harbour. That was excellent, buddy. Good pleasure, my friend. All right, all right. The music doesn't end there. Coming up next, Quiet Hollers.